That's why I'm persistent today, Mr. Right. You bet I am! I like riding on this! I honestly... I honestly don't think... Ooh! I love this music. Uh, but... Yeah, no, like... I, I don't think that he would honestly... Get like this. Like, I honestly think that he would be much better... To, like, you know... I, I think that he would honestly be more prepared and better... Than this as it is right now. Like, he's sweating, his testimony is, like, not airtight, you know? I just feel like he'd be a little bit better than this. Like, it, that, that, that's like the only thing that I can honestly think that is honestly wrong with this entire scenario here. Unless Phoenix Wright was honestly just that good. As you know, Mr. White is the CEO of Blue Corp. He ordered his secretary, Ms. April May, to tap the law offices of Miss Fay. What does that have to do, Your Honor? The question is, when was the wiretap placed in the office? And by who? No. You wouldn't. Mr. White, in order to place the wiretap, you entered Miss Fay's office. Am I correct? Ah, Edgeworth. You sack of filth. Oh, I hate you, Edgeworth. Why is it that you have to be so ridiculous? Hold up, wait. Wait, he's saying that he breached it. He breached it, but he had Miss May do it for him. That makes no sense! Like, how does that make any... any sense? Like, oh my god. Edgeworth, you are... I, I hate you so much! Like, jeez. Look. It is a fact that Mr. White has been to that office well before the murder took place. <laughs> oh, dear God, yes. When he went to place the wiretap. He could have seen the glass sta light stand then. Ergo, Mr. Phoenix Wright's theory is revealed for this baseless conjecture. It is. <laughs> But, 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 that also doesn't make any sense. You stated prior that it was Miss April May. You said it was Miss April May. So why... He has a good reason to feel faint. This... My brain! <clears throat> It was be the beginning of September, the week before the murder. I had entered the Fay and Cola offices. Of course I had done so to place the wiretap. That is when I saw this glass light stand. Hmm. So, you saw the stand before the night of the incident. And this is how you were able to identify who had fallen over by the sound? Good act! That is right. I see. Very well, Mr. Wright. You may cross-examine. What am I supposed to do now? 
She's just off her. She's like, I'm completely lost. Good luck. Okay, so hold up. There has to be. Uh. September 5th. Oh boy. Um. Um. Ooh. Let's try pressing here. Why did you tap Maya's phone? Objection! This has no bearing on the current case, Your Honor. Blue Corp is a detective agency of sorts. With the responsibility to protect client confidentiality. Was it really you that went into the office? Or was it Miss May? Well, identifying fingerprints several days ago were found in the Fane Co. Law Offices. Those were obviously Mr. Wyatt's. Have I know Edgeworth? He's already ran a check on those prints. Now, Mr. Wyatt, tell us why you went to the Fane Co. Law Offices. I feel like the wiretap here. Why did you notice something as innocuous as a light stick? How do I know that word? How? I don't even know anymore. <laughs> the light stand was made entirely out of glass. It was quite stylish. So I guess it made a lasting impression on me. Such a beaudacious thing deserves attention, does it not? That is all. I'm gonna try the wire tap. No, that was wrong. Yeah, see, okay, that was our first. Huh. Oh, this one's hard, guys. Let's see. Beginning of September. That is not the begin. I wonder. Objection. No, okay. Huh. This one has me stumped. supposed to be was that honestly supposed to be like something I can't Phoenix Phoenix over here I know that voice oh god hold the phone wait what was her voice again <clears throat> never give up Phoenix 
maybe a little bit more. <clears throat> Never give up, Phoenix. Yeah. M M Mia? Maya, Mia, 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 Mia. Where, where am I? The waiting lobby. What happened? Oh, right. I lost the trial. I was hallucinating. Ah, you're finally awake. Gah! Hey, Phoenix. Gak? That's no way to greet an old friend. Phoenix, I want you to look at me. And then here's where Maya's ability comes into play. M Maya! Didn't you know the Fey women have strong psychic powers? When you accepted your defeat in court, it appears that was enough of a shock to awaken Maya's true powers. Oh, Maya's channeling you, Mia. That's right. I am Maya. But I'm also Mia. It's a Mia. Now, I want you to listen to me, Phoenix. Maya never gave up. You can't either. That's what I came here to tell you. Uh, but we don't have much time, Phoenix. Now listen. You've already won. Huh? You have that receipt in the court record, right? Um, oh yeah. The one you wrote Maya on. Phoenix. White wrote that, not me. So, now what do I do with it? Look at the front of the receipt. The front. It's a regular receipt. Looks like it's from a famous department store. 1,000. Wow, big spender. Item. Last light stand. Date of purchase. September 4. September 4? That's right, Phoenix. I bought that stand in the day before I was killed. Whoa! Now, what did Mr. White say in his testimony? It was the beginning of September, the week before the murder. He said he saw the stand the week before the murder. There you go. I think the court is about to reconvene. Go do it, Phoenix. You know you're innocent. Now you just have to prove it. Right! Receipt updated in the court record. So basically that entire thing was a red flipping herring to throw you off. And I honestly hate it when that happens, but sometimes it does happen. Is, is the defendant rather, are you all right, Mr. Wright? Yes, sorry, your honor. I'm fine now. Then let us start where we left off. Your Honor, there is nothing to go back to. The cross-examining of Mr. White is finished. That is all required now is for you to pass judgment on the defendant, Phoenix Wright. Hmm. Your Honor, please give me one more chance. I promise you, this is the last time I'll ask you. Hmm. But, as Mr. Edgeworth s has noted, the trial is more or less finished. Mr. Edgeworth, do you have an opinion on this matter? I say, let us give Mr. Phoenix Wright his last chance. Very well. You may begin your cross-examination. Alright. And then, friggin' like, well... <laughs> Here we go! Look closely at this. See the word Maya written in blood. <laughs> You're grasping. I think not. Look at the other side of the receipt. The, the other side? Your Honor, would you tell the court what is written on the other side of that receipt? Well, a glass light stand, and the date of purchase, 
Why, that's the day before the murder! You see? Mr. White. When you allegedly entered Famco Law Offices at the beginning of September, the stand could not have been there. Uh, uh, I'm not touching that. I, I'm simply not touching any screaming going on there. Well, Mr. Ray, can't get out of this one, can you? No, it is impossible. Achievable. Uh oh, he's losing it. Well, Your Honor, I understand there must be quite a bit of pressure on you. But I think you'll agree when you can't judge me guilty under these circumstances. Very well. Then, that is all for the trial of. Objection! Edgeworth, you sack of filth. <laughs> Not so fast, Phoenix Wright. Eh? Uh? What, what? No way he can worm his way out of this one. Oh wait, I forgot. It's Edgeworth. There is a certain thread of logic to the defendant's claim. However, there is no concrete proof that Phoenix Wright is innocent. Uh, uh, ergo... I would like to request one more day before Phoenix Wright is granted his freedom. I need time to make one more inquiry into this matter. Hmm. Another inquiry? This isn't going to be another one of those updated autopsy reports. This guy just makes up evidence as he pleases. This is bad. Object! Mr. White's guilt is obvious. There's no need to prolong this trial any further. Hmm. Well, Mr. Edgeworth? If anyone is gonna go Mr. Wright to trial, it will be me, the prosecution. I need a day to ascertain whether these new claims have any basis in the factual evidence. <laughs> hmm. I see. Objection denied. The completion of the trial of Mr. Phoenix Wright will be postponed until tomorrow. No! There's no telling what will happen if I can't end this now. Edgeworth is sure to come up with, or just make up something, after Mia showed up to help me and all. Mr. Your Honor, may I go home? Of course. Thank you for your time. Gah! Uh, the witness will stay. M Mia? Phoenix, read this note out loud. M Mia, what's this? Memo. Your Honor, if I may. You're quite persistent today, Mr. Wright. You bet I am. My life's riding on this. I have something I would like to read to the court. The memo Mia had given me was a list of names. Many of them sounded strangely familiar. People in finance. Famous celebrities. That's what it had. Stop! This is... Halt! Please! Stop! Make him stop! How? How did you get that list? Mr. White. Admit your guilt. Right here right now, or else this list will be the release to the press. I, I confess, I confess, I, I did it, I hit her, I hit Miss Mia with the thinker. Case closed, your honor. <laughs> Well, I see no reason to continue this trial. Mr. Wright. Yes, Your Honor? You've done it again! It was quite a spirited defense. I guess this one wasn't... So where does the sandwich come into play? I guess you could say that. 
If only if you knew how spirited it was. Rather than offended. <laughs> Yay! That is all. Court is adjourned. Huh. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe I'm thinking of a completely different game. I remember a sandwich. Well, I never thought I'd be saying this again. But congratulations! You're lucky as I was born a You're lucky I was born a fag. I'm lucky I had both you and my on my side to be perfectly honest. Oh two great women in my life that I have ever known. Maybe I should marry into the Pavis family. You know? Phoenix? Come on, buddy! <laughs> I mean, you know, you have your chance. Do it, dude! Just, like, tie the knot with Maya. Just, just ask for hand in marriage and whatnot. God forbid! <laughs> as long as you live. My time here is running out. Huh? Maya's powers are still weak. I can't stay here that long. What? No! There's still so much to say! Don't worry. I'm sure we'll meet again. Chief! <laughs> I'm not Chief anymore. Phoenix, you come to the office tonight. Say, 9 o'clock. The office? I'll see you later. Chief! Mia! Say 9 o'clock where another murder can happen. It's time for you to go, Phoenix. Phoenix, you're late! It, already by two minutes? Come on, dude! Being here, it's hard not to think about that night. You came. Mia. I was kind of, I was kind of worried you might not. Huh? Of course I came. Well then. Pretty hungry. How about a burger? Mia? <laughs> you should see your face. Mia? Ah. Uh. Ugh. Mm. I want to smooch you. What are you talking about? It's me, Maya. M Maya? What? Did I look like my sister? Look like you were her. Hmm. I might be able to use that. Well, oh, Phoenix, go to the store and buy me lunch, would you? Um, uh, Maya, why are you here? Because of this. See, you yeah, wrote me a letter. Take care of Phoenix for me. Take care of... Huh. She means the office. This office. Someone has to help with the new Right and Co. Law offices. Right? And who better but me? My FA, reporting for duty. Wait, no. On second thought. Let's make this casual. Yo, Nick. Maya here. Ready to get down to business. Yo, yo, yo. Wiki wiki whack! Oh god no! You don't mind me calling you Nick, do you? It's a great name! Why I said that it's what your friend Larry calls you! Nick. You know what this means? We're partners! Partners! You know, when I think about it, it's Maya's fault I'm here now. But if it wasn't for her. I'd probably be in jail. Right in co-law offices. It's got a good ring to it. Yeah. Thanks, Maya. Oh god, there's a ghost! Oh god, what the frick is that? Good luck, Phoenix. I'll always be here. Okay, Nick, let's do it! Huh? Do, do what? Do what indeed? Burgers! Has to be burgers! 
Oh, there's a great burger joint down this, just down the street. Oh, thank God it was burgers. But man, Maya's very hungry for those buns. Ooh. Ooh, that, and that pretty much ends the entirety of Roundabout 2. Oh no. Oh no, I... I remember this one. Oh no, and there's the one lady. Oh no, please, anything. Oh, there she is! No. Oh god. Oh. Okay. Well, if anything! Thank you all so very much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this recording of Phoenix Wright. Ace Attorney. You know, the one, the trilogy. Yeah. So. Are you guys enjoying this so far? Let me know in the comments down below, and I'll see you all in the next recording.